So Tyson Fury beats Derek Chisora in the 10th round. That was very one-sided. You know, very one-sided fight. Derek Chisora doesn't have the physical tools to beat Tyson Fury. Lacks the height, lacks the reach, lacks the punch power. Um, now he's getting older. 38 years old. That was never going to end well. Unless Derek Chisora landed a fluke overhand right. He landed about one in the fight. This fight was somewhat of a warm-up for Tyson Fury. Tyson Fury was carrying Derek Chisora in my opinion. I actually thought, is Tyson Fury going to let Derek Chisora get to the end of the fight? He definitely held back in that fight in my opinion. So, I don't know what more to say about the fight really. I don't know what more to say about it. Um... I don't know. I honestly don't know what more to say. Derek Chisora looks like he's decreased um, with age. Uh, it looks like he can't consistently walk down an opponent anymore. Um, he was very brave. Let you know. Let me say that Derek Chisora very brave in the fight. Um, definitely took his punishment. Um, not much more to say, really. Um, not much more to say. So if I talk about after the fight. Um, after the fight who is Tyson Fury going to face next is he going to face um, Alexander Usyk hopefully I think that is a hard fight for Tyson Fury people going on about Tyson Fury being the best he needs to beat Usyk before anyone can start saying that because I think Alexander Usyk gives him a lot of trouble you know Tyson Fury was Pykic, you know, how, how tall was Pykic? You know, is Tyson Fury someone who, um, let me have a look at the height of um, Pykic here. Um, so looking into Tyson Fury, I'm just opening up box rec. Um, Tyson Fury fought, uh, let's have a look. Uh, Pykage, six foot three, so not at all heavyweight. He fought Pykage, and he was, and he got knocked down in that fight. He fought uh, John McDermott, who's six foot three, and he, in my opinion, lost the first fight. Uh, and then he fought. He fought Steve Cunningham and got knocked down in that fight and in my opinion really struggled in that fight. And Steve Cunningham is how tall? Six foot three. I think Tyson Fury struggles against smaller fighters, smaller heavyweights. Six foot three is not a small height. Um, it's a lot taller than me. But six foot three is, sh you know, medium short for a heavyweight. And um, Tyson Fury is struggling against fighters who are six foot three. Alexander Usyk is, you know, a short heavyweight, and I think Tyson Fury struggles against short guys. Um, you know, I think he struggles against the short guys. Um, I know Steve Cunningham used to be a cruiserweight. Um, Steve Cunningham used to be a cruiserweight. Uh, let's uh, having, having a look at this um, Pikage guy. Uh, now nah, Pikage was a heavyweight. So Tyson Fury struggles against short fighters. I'm not convinced that um, with the Alexander Usyk fight, the Tyson Fury just destroys him easy. I don't. I don't see it. Because everything that Tyson Fury's got, Tyson Fury is good because he's got very fast hands for a heavyweight his size. And he's got the size, and he's got the foot speed. But the foot speed is slower than Usyk, and the hand speed is slower than Usyk, and the coordination is less than Usyk. So a lot of the advantages that you see Tyson Fury with against other heavyweights, he's not going to have that against Usyk. How does he handle that? So I don't think it's a foregone conclusion that he goes in there and beats Usyk. A lot of people think it's that. I don't think it's that. I think a lot of people are missing out on Usyk's southpaw, um, the southpaw element of the fight. 
the foot speed, the hand speed, the coordination. I think people are missing out on this. And I think Yusuf gives Tyson Fury a lot of trouble. So let's see what happens there. I really want to see that fight. Um, let's hope it happens. What did you make of the performance? I mean, for me, you know, if, oh, I can't really say much more than I've already said on that one. Um, you know, shout out to Derek Chisora for showing the bravery. And obviously Tyson Fury, you know, he, he put in the performance. So make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, hit the notification bell so you get a notification when I make a new video. And I'll see you on the next video.